internet, this is Z Schrodinger's Cat, and welcome to another episode of The Witcher. Last time we found this witch, uh, Cynthia, and she's doing some shady crap for, uh, for Nilfgaard, but we decided to help anyway because we want the stuff that she wants for ourselves. And we also can't, uh, in good conscience, reject a good side quest. So, uh, we are following, uh, proceed through the sewers to the laboratory. Uh, can, I just, I just want silver ore, guys. It's, it's all, I, it's all I want. What's through here? Uh, they're gonna like go on, but I have important looting to do. It's important, it, very, very important. I know, Cynthia, you think uh, your mission is important, but it's not nearly as important as what I'm doing here, um, which is collecting wealth, looking for silver ore, uh, looking for potential butt plugs. What's through here? I don't know. Uh, I can I can come back here later, I guess, after the quest is that I got through in time. Yes. <laughs> All right, through here. Uh, loots, loots. This seems like a good place to pick up silver ore. Well, I can garden, uh, at the very least. Uh, iron ore, not what I need, not what I need, not what I need. Uh, please, uh, deliver onto me silver ore. I need seven of it for my super mega sword. Uh. Let's see. Hello! We go? Go through? Head on through. Ah! Ah! No, 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 no! Ah! 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 Nosies, 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 no. No. Please put me after the dialogue. God, I hope I saved after the dialogue. Please put me after. Okay, good, 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 good. I don't think I've. I don't think this is post looting though, so I gotta do that again. And loot. Yep. I don't. I gotta do that again. Okay, so, uh, ooh, I got, I just got 350 orins. Damn, son, this was worth it. This was worth coming down here. Jeez, lord, time to take out my sword and advance this. Uh, take, pick up this iron ore that we don't need because we have like eight bazil bazillion million of it. And it's weighing down our inventory like mad, but, um, we need it. So, we'll go through here, uh. Can. Ah! Pfft. That's not what I wanted to do. Thank you. Uh, and then through here. Please. Through the door. Thanks. Thanks. Uh, let's stay in the corner. Come on. Uh, let's switch. And quack. Quack. They'll deal with those. Damn, you got a lot of health. Good Christ. Lots of health you got. My lord. Goodbye. Ah. If you don't mind me, I'll kill ya. Raider rot team. I feel like I'm not doing as much damage as I should do these. But, uh, whatever. Maybe I'm just not really putting my heart into it. So I gotta put my heart into it. I gotta believe in the heart of my sword. Uh, please give me the loots. Thank you! Nilfgaardian Leather Gushbaga. Is those better than what I have? Uh, Nilfgaardian Leather... Mm, no, they suck. Okay. Well, they don't suck, they just... Whoa! Hey! Hey! Enough with your loading animations! Uh... No loots? No loots from the Raffines? Good Christ. Game saved. Where? What? What? What horrors await me in this part of the sewers? Uh, plants? Thanks. I don't know how I reached those. They were like t two of me above my head, but whatever. No complaints. Whoa! Hi, Dragers. Oh man, I'm two shotting the Dra in Dragos with this uh, thing now. It's pretty cool. 
And Dra Queen Andrega, huh? I've never fought one of those before. I need something from it, though. I think. It's like something... I don't know. We're on a mage battle together. I will say, this is fun. However, I may be helping Nilf Nilfgaard, but uh, this is quite fun. Just killing these dudes. Good, good, good adventure. Uh... Bye bye. Can I loot you guys, please? Oh, hey. You're still here. Wah. Goodbye. Mm. Please give me the loots. Uh, find the laboratory. Out of my laboratory! So much loots. Give. 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 Over here. Bump, 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 bump. What's it here? Ah, Wraith! Wraith to sisses! Guys, Wraiths! Uh, I found- I found Wraiths. Um, they're over here. If- if you could, maybe help. Uh, assistance, uh, would be appreciated. Uh, though, if I bottleneck them here, I shouldn't have too much difficulty. Whoa! 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 What the hell are you, Draugr? Uh, we got a bit of a Wraith problem, guys. Um, I don't know where you went, but, uh, there's a bit of a wraith problem. But they don't seem to want to go outside of this doorway here, so... Uh, uh, jogger? Let me out. Boop. Go away, maybe? Uh... <laughs> What are they- what are you screaming about? Whoa. Please let me out. Alright. This is a very useful door, I will say. A 10 out of 10 door rating. I would- 5 stars. Would use door again. Uh. Just mostly wait- ooh, it died. It died it died. Whoa, there's a lot of them. Holy crap sticks. There's like a room full of them. A whole room full of them. This is like where all the race hang out. It's like the race fraternity. They have like race initiations where you have to do race keg stands. Which is just like regular keg stands, except you're dead. Uh, so it takes a lot more to, to, to really get into the Wraith fraternity because you're dead anyway, so you really gotta prove yourself in the Wraith keg stand, keg stand initiation, uh, um, you okay there? Uh, you seem a little bit, uh, trapped. There's like a named mob in there. Uh, Brooks. Goodbye, Brooks. This this one's kind of a little bit stuck. Uh, and brat. Goodbye. I killed all of them. He did it. I I I proved myself. I ca can I join the Wraith frater fraternity now? I know your initiation is more keg stand and, and less murdering everyone in the fraternity, but still. Sting. What's sting? Uh, what's that? It's a ranged weapon, uh, which is useless because I never use those. Uh, and every time I see one, I remember that I took the ranged uh, weapon perk, and I regret it every time. I feel deep, deeply regretful. Uh, hold on. Did those dra draggers not drop anything? Well, uh, uh, whatever. I got the XP. That's all I care about. Give. Uh, ooh. Got a whole bunch of crap. Um, let's see. Which way can I go? I can go this way? Or I can go this way? Hold on. Hold on. I found loot. I found loot. I saw a prompt. Give me the prompt. Thank you. And save. Okay. Uh, I don't know which way is progress and which way is not progress. Oh, that's progress, because they're over there. Uh, so this is unprogress. What's over here? Mm -hmm. Damn, hey! You're ugly. 
You are quite ugly, yes, that is accurate. <laughs> Whoa! Why you- oh, you got poisoned by your own dead friends. That must suck. That's like adding insult to injury. Please? Oh, you're still here. Uh, join the afterlife. You'll see your friends in, in, in uh, raw fiend heaven. With, which is just like regular heaven, except everything's rotting. It's like, you got clouds, but they're like covered in, in rot. But that's okay, because that's, that's what raw fiend heaven is really about is just rotting everywhere and they they like it they do uh they they approve of it come on give me the shinies thank you uh more shinies give me the shinies uh i i i'm getting a lot of iron ore and not silver ore which i have iron ore already i'm swimming and i'm balls deep in iron ore but uh not so much in silver ore hold on Onward we go, to join our, uh, treasonous mage, uh, buddies. Yep. Uh, I got orange, so that's cool. I'm no rat to run around sewers. What we're looking for, anyway? Some graves, I heard. Graves? So maybe there is something in this forest. Shut your traps. Want the sergeant to hear? We've been deep shite. But it is a good idea. We I hope you don't expect me to Redanian sneak, bastards. cause I'm uh, not gonna at all. I might try, but uh, you guys, you guys do that. I got uh, in here to look at. I got uh, what? What do we got here? Uh, hold on, hold on. Let me see it. Jesus Lord, what do I gotta do to pick up a prop? I got, I don't know, plants. I guess. Hold, give, give. Ooh, orange. And that's it. That's it. Okay, through this way. Safe. All right. Hold on. I gotta make sure I'm not missing any cool loot. The entrance must be somewhere here. If our experts are to be trusted, their hammer dabbled in illusions, among other things. He also experimented heavily with golems. Golems with the power of speech, supposedly. They knew nothing of poetry, but will you two shut up? Yes, it's an illusion. I found a weak spot. Stand back. Later, later, Elon. Lisa, Elon. Later, dear. Excuse All right. At times, I'm caught. You can get my kind of feet. Though I have no needles, they say I am piercing. What am I? A porcupine? Careful with the answer. It could be a trap. Typical of dear Hannah. He was a genius with a penchant for mischievous jokes. Like a child. So a couple of adults, purported experts, should have no problem solving this. Indeed, it's trivial. The answer is pain. In nah, I would have gone with Hedgehog. Ha! <laughs> See? Should have gone with Hedgehog. Talk to Impossible. the guardian. So many years of research. Capable of kindness and cruelty. I take victims when I sour. I can be on your side or wrong you. I bring gifts though you already have me. Uh, a river, an elf, love, a lover, a king, fate. Repeat the riddle. Can you please repeat the riddle. Capable of kindness and cruelty, I take victims when I sour. I can be on your side or wrong you. I bring gifts though you already have me. Uh... I'm gonna go with fate. Fate. Correct. Aha! It's going rather well so far. Not for everybody. Not for everybody! <laughs> Someone's been here recently. Clean up your messes, guys. This whole place is a mess. Mm. 
More iron ore. Too bad about Gaspar. Please? Loot? Can I have? Can I have? I wager. We have a few more of Dear Hannah's surprises for unwanted visitors. What's over here? Uh. No! Indeed. Uh, bleeding plus 25%. Silver sword, damage 43 to 45. Oh, crap. Worth. 100% worth. Onward we go. Okay. Through here? Yeah. Well, well. The competition's here. Kill them. Jeez. Uh, my oh my. Aha! You guys are quite weak to fire. Like, damn. You guys are having a rough time there. Goodbye. Here's a question. Does sign bonus on swords count when you don't have the sword out? I got some books. All right, it's time for reading. Reading Rainbow, Legendary Treasures. Among the acknowledged treasures of the, this is a long thing. Among the acknowledged treasures of the last century, three have gained exceptional fame. First is the Amber Chamber, which Verfoyal De Denevan's father took as a spoil when he defeated Medell of Tamaria. The breathtaking masterpiece, the chamber's decor made entirely from amber, was sadly lost to the storm of war. Either buried or destroyed, all traces of it have disappeared. The secret treasure belongs to a dragon oxy <laughs> known as the Crystal Mountains or the Mountains of Burning Sands. Uh, a group led by Yarp and Zergen killed the beast and took this treasure, which includes sapphires similar, similar in hue and... Uh, in hue and diamonds as large as cherries. Said gems are sent to the jewelry market in, in, in disarray. A legendary treasure of this mystery is shrouded in mystery. Yes, that is definitely what that sentence said. For both of its composition and the details of how and where it would fade found and remain secret. One thing is certain, it includes ancient artifacts of untold power. One of the items exploded, claiming the lives of three of the five mages studying it. Rip, that's, uh, uh it passed the test, 60%. That's, uh, that's enough to pass on um, the mage killing test. The world at large might have heard about the discovery of the occasion, but not long after the tragic accident, the veil silenced into the centers of the... Uh, what else did I, what else did I get? Um... Legendary treasures and astrological clues. A long time ago, the princes of Brennevid argued the power of the, septs, the, the depths. My reading, um, I need to upgrade my reading stat. Uh, perhaps even the gods themselves. A sea dragon began to prowl the coast of waters, killing fishermen and pearl hunters. Poverty and hunger threatened the principality, so the ruler decided to appease the sea by sacrificing a maiden. For, the, for in those dark times, and that was a very matter for dealing with economic crisis. It seems legit. Uh, <laughs> luckily for the young woman, a witcher was in the area. Strolling along the beach, he noticed the serp serpentine beast emerging from the water towards the last, who climbed to the seaside rock in less than decent pose. The witcher killed the dragon, freed the woman, and, as circumstances tell, plunged her, uh, plowed her with her consent on the aforementioned rock. <laughs> nice. Nailed it. Uh, we can see a reflection of these events in the summer sky on condition that our silver lady does not show her face. There is a feel for, fearful last looking westwards, the dragon sliding even closer, and beyond this, the witch are sneaking up to the beast from behind. Great. I don't know what that uh, uh, tells us, but uh, make sure there's no more things to steal. Uh, stealing. Uh, another book! Time for more reading! Reading, as we know, is for everyone. The gnomes and of Macahan and Turchukshe. In the north, gnomes are widely known to inhabit at Macaron where they coexist in full harmony with the dwarves without any discord that usually arrives with two races single settle area. Reading. Both the gnomes and dwarves of the mountain region make a living by mining and 
accessing the untold mineral riches from there. Yet the mountain, hills, and values of Magwakal are not home to the largest gnomish population. The honor belongs to Tirchekhul, where the diminutive creatures produce the legendary weapons that are then exported both north and south. The famous Gwekhwa, forged according to gnomish technology, are reported to be the best blades in the world, though less known for the swords themselves, the blast furnace and steam hammers which the gnomes and dwarves use to smelt metal and work allies deserve the same admiration. Few know that Tirchekhul became a leading export of beautiful opals after an earthquake revealed thick seams of the precious material. Gnomes are uh, uh, urine, u unrivaled masters of the jeweler's craft in Mount on the slope of which collapsed the real mountains and now call trim in the Great. I don't know what that was all about. Uh, there's a door. There is another friggin' book. Uh, another friggin' book. Ugh. Archaeological charts. Ooh, look. This seems like it will be involved in a puzzle. Uh, of sorts. And... Whoa! Lag. Lag. I, it glows when I go near it. That's cool. That's cool. This glows when I go near it, too. They all glow. Look at this. Look at the glow. Glow. Uh. Glow. Uh, hello? One buffoon less. Locked. A group of travelers wandering through the dark. Three guides above them, so three were marked. At night they trailed a drake serpentine and a silver lady shining and fine. If only her visage she would deign to unfold. By day they followed a mountain vault, its riches untold. Did I hear someone complain about the riddles being too easy? <laughs> Let's think this through. There are nine alcoves, a fresco in each. That's three groups of three frescoes. The riddle mentions three guides above the travelers. We must examine the frescoes, seek answers there. Mm. I'll advise you about the riddle, but I will not take part in disarming the device. I've got a bad feeling about this. Wimp. The first verse. I should look at the frescoes. Um, solve the riddle. Place yourself and two of your companions on the right things? Uh, talk? A group of travelers wandering through the dark. Three guides above them, so, so three, three were marked. marked. Okay, three, three people At wandering night, around. they trailed a drake serpentine. Dragon. And a silver lady shining and fine. That's, that's the story visage, that we read about the lady who was saved. Unfold. By day they followed a mountain vault. Maybe not. Its riches untold. Uh, the first verse? What do you think of the first verse? I would say it describes a serpentine dragon swallowing its own tail, which represents infinity and thus time. The hourglass likewise symbolizes time. In this case, the time of the traveler's journey. Okay, so I time's one of them. It's the dragon constellation. It would be visible at night. Watch more, sources on alchemy invariably portray dragons as winged, and as an accomplished alchemist, Dehenna would also be a competent astrologer. The verse must refer to the constellation. So time and dragon. In alchemy, the winged serpentine dragon represents prime matter, an essential component in the process of alchemical transformation. The verse seems to indicate the allegory illustrating that transformation. Uh, the hourglass, the dragon constellation, the allegory of all chemical transformation. Let's analyze it again. How did that line go again? Can someone remind me how the line was worded? The first verse was, at night they trailed a drake serpentine. Okay, let's analyze it again. The first verse. I would say it describes a serpentine... Oh, that's just the same dialogue. Uh, the allegory of Everything chemical transmutation. The allegory of alchemical transformation. I shall take that one. Uh, the second verse? The second verse. To my mind, it speaks of the white rose, symbol of the order of the flaming rose. You see, the fresco itself I don't think I do, I'm doing it right. Arms, and in heraldry, silver is rendered as white. So the silver lady and white rose are one and the same. I think it describes the full moon. In alchemy, the moon represents both silver as a metal and the feminine element. The world remains largely unknown in the south, so the white rose seems unlikely. 
Every Nilfgaardian, on the other hand, has heard of the Imperial Nausicaa Brigade, which has the Death's Head as its symbol. The brigade's name is female, and they say death follows a unit. This is like so, the so much information well in Nausicaa my brain. Or the Death's Head. Uh, yeah, about moon. I think it's the full moon. Allow me. Third verse. Say to the third verse. It describes the precipice, the ravine amidst mountains. An ancient rule in alchemy states, as above, so below. The vault is the ravine into which the riches of the mountain flow. We must read the third line literally. To me, it suggests the Mahakam Mountains and its mines, from which dwarves and gnomes extract many ores that are invaluable to alchemists. Those mountains are a vault in and of themselves. The verse is not literal. In many legends, towers are in fact vaults, which the hero must penetrate in order to rescue an imprisoned princess or find a long concealed magic your vault. item. The mountain vault I'm 12. is the tower. Um, the mine entrance in the mountainside? I don't know. The mine entrance in the mountainside. That seems logical. I'll stand next to that fresco. Uh... Let's give it a Let's shot. Let's solve this. Take your places. Count me out. I want to live. As you will. What? Huh? Nope. That's not right. We must try another combination. That's not right. Uh, sad face. Ow! Squat, squat it out. Douche novels. Come on. Is that everyone? Give me your loots. Okay. Can I? Can I please? Please. Right, gargoyles, gargoyle innards. Excuse me. Excuse me. Hmm. Hmm. All right. Talk. One buffoon less. Talk. I cannot hope to finish the research. One alone. buffoon okay. less. Can I? What? Who do I talk to about? What? A group of travelers wandering through the dark okay. at night. All right. The first verse. Uh Dragon it should be the dragon constellation. I shall take that one. Second verse. Mm, moon? I think it's the full moon. Allow me. Third verse. Mine entrance. The mine entrance in the mountainside. That seems logical. I'll stand next to that fresco. Let's, Let's give it a shot, guys. This. Take your places. Count me out. I want to live. As you will. Um. Where are we going? Here? Intruder detected. No! Well. There goes him. That obvious... Oh. oh! Oh! Okay. I, I can't tell if we did it right or not. Uh, Our expedition has grown thin. Such a shame. I actually found those two amusing. What happened to those dudes? Of course, my lady. Can I loot your corpse? No, I can't loot your corpse in front of all your friends. Is this dude, like, our friend, or are we gonna have to kill him? A golem. So dare Hannah's legend is true. It is no more than an obedient machine created to follow orders and kill. Not unlike our witcher. Um, kiss my <laughs> ass? Famously. Hugh, what do you know about golems? I don't run into them in every forest, but any good bestiary describes golems at length, and I've read more than my share of those. Geralt, I'm not questioning your knowledge, but I should be the one to... Actually, you are questioning my knowledge. Listen, I know what I'm doing. I'll try to get it to reveal the word that'll deactivate it. Or I'll just mess with its head. Break the code. So now we've got a burglar in our midst. Be my guest. Try. My intentions are good. As are mine. Know, however, that this may change. 
Derhanna must have been pretty lonely if he gave you eloquence. The master made me a guardian. Nothing less. Of the galaxy? And Do you is there is there the like a green woman and uh, like a talking whatever he, squirrel? Uh, what exactly are you? Aware you're an automaton. Do you really know who we are? We're gonna listen to where some sweet from, 80s tracks. And where we are headed is human life. Predictable in that the cycle of birth and death ensnares it better than mine. When a human is born, he is obedient to his parents. Later, he listens to tutors, masters, corporals. Finally, he succumbs to the will of death. That is depressing I and accurate. Bear question, dear Hannah's mastery. Uh, has anyone tried to enter before us? Who is allowed to pass? Can I make uh, sovereign? De can you make sovereign decisions? Uh, can you make you are sovereign far decisions? More self-aware than a typical golem. Can you make sovereign decisions? The master made me the way I am because long discussions were to his liking. So he was so I lonely that he just made a giant talking rock force. that he could talk to instead so of going up and like making real friends. Who else would? Eh. Guests chat no judgment. innocuously, exerting no pressure, while others are intruders. Has anyone tried Has to anyone enter? tried to enter before? I recall no intruders. I do, however, remember guests who left after being warned. When was that? What did you discuss? I am a machine. My memory is limited. Sounds like you need to... And get some Who, more RAM. If anyone is allowed to pass. Dear Hanna, but he is dead. Also, guests may pass, but I stop intruders. Tell me more. Who's a guest and who's an intruder? Is it not obvious? A guest keeps his distance or knows the name word. An intruder is anyone who enters too far, attacks me, or otherwise interferes with my being. Uh, I have other questions. I have other questions. Who created, uh, well, we know who created you. Do you have Did a name? Did creator give you a name? I'm called Obedience. Well, Denovan, or whatever his name, gave, gave you, he's created. I am a guardian and the humblest of servants. A golem's name is the word that gave it life and that can take it away. You must have a name. I own nothing. Everything belongs to my master. How could I divulge the name if I exist solely to protect my creator's property? Uh, easily. You just say it with your mouth? Powerful magic created you. Derhanna was a true master. He is still, since his mastery survives. Derhanna, that's the guy. Uh, you are self-aware. Are you lonely? Can I ask you about your program? Can I ask uh, for your name word? Uh, you are self-aware. Are you lonely? You must be lonely here. You are wrong. The pain of the world, melancholy, lies within the domain of emotions and feelings. My thoughts are governed by pure logic, restricted by my program. But you can learn. They say that a penchant for philosophy can only come from curiosity. In my case, it comes from the will of the master, who liked to speak with me. And do you what did you talk about? Do you, do you know his nothing. fetishes? Um, his, um, his shippings? His waifu? Who's his waifu? Can I ask Can about your program? The program that controls your behavior? Of course not. <laughs> Can I ask for Can your I name ask word? You for the name word which brought you to life and which can deactivate Why? Yeah, why would he tell do me that? that? And I shall consider you an intruder. Yeah. Like why? <laughs> I have other questions. Uh, who I I know who Do created you, you creator? but of course I was some I'm just interested about what the dialogue is. Hannah. I abide by his will, by his power, by the necessity encased in my stone bowels. Yeesh. Derhenna is dead. His word, which animates me, lives on, as does his legacy, which I protect. Empires will rise and fall. Rivers will shift their courses, but I will remain obedient to one master on my eternal watch. 
That sounds really uh, depressing. Uh, I think you're, you're a living being. You're not an being. automaton. You're self-aware, and you think you can make decisions. Oh, it failed. You're wrong. I am eloquent and can discern between guests and intruders. I can also deal with the latter. But everything I say and do is limited by my restrictive program. By the way, as an automaton, I am immune to all <laughs> Okay. Ah. Touche. the intruders. Oh no. I had a feeling this might happen. Take that. I had a feeling this might happen. But it was worth a shot anyway. Oh dear, there are many. There are sure a whole lot. Oh good lord. Uh, if I die, I think I shall take a different approach. Holy crap sticks. Holy crap sticks. Oh my. Oh jeez. Oh lord. Oh lord. Oh no. He's not good. He's not good. He's no bueno. Quack. 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 Whoa, whoa. I might win this, could win this, potentially, if I play my cards right, uh, aka don't suck. Uh, I think we got one of them dead, actually. Um, this roll, rolling thing that I got, very helpful. Rolling is exceptionally good. I can't imagine any reason why you wouldn't take that rolling card, it is amazing. No, 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 no bleeding. This is what happens when you stop using the fire. This is why fire is so good. Because it doesn't lead to bleeding. Unlike dumb swords. I'm also a huge fan of how it stuns them. I mean, that's pretty cool. Uh, search the laboratory with uh, Adelbert and Cynthia. Can I loot, please? Elemental stone. Huh. Success for Nilfgaard this mission. Maybe you'll get that promotion. Safe. Okay. Anything else in here? Uh, search for Orans. That's a door. Uh. Dear Hema's notes. Uh. Inventory. A lot of reading in this episode. The head of notes three. I have finally reached the place description by uh, Giovith. My worst suspicion has been confirmed as I have found cells filled with the bones of lizard men. There are more documents too. If, we, if the figures can be trusted, the mutated virus was terrifyingly effective. The reptile's tissue <laughs> must have decomposed instantly. You feel that? Yikes. Vibrating. Another masking illusion. I'll try to disperse it. Wait for Cynthia's spell to take effect. Oh my. Examine dear Hannah's artifact. The device. What is it? You've done your job. You'll be paid and... Paid like the scholars were? They died once they were no longer useful. They were never useful, but Cynthia insisted. Fortunately, they were so kind as to remove themselves without my help. I'm not about to be that kind. Adelbert, you know what you're to look for. Yes, ma'am. It's a prototype megascope. I didn't know it had survived. What's it do? The artifact detects an emotional bond with a person. Its user need only focus on that person and the device will establish a connection. Great mm. tool for a spy. Yes. Time you fulfilled your end of the bargain. What do you know about my past? You were a rider of the Wild Hunt. I read the Damn. Reports. Don't the North Guardians have anything better to do than write reports about witchers? Not about witchers. About you. You are the sole person to have been a member of the Host. And survived. So I was, like, possessed or something? Okay, anything else? Anything else? Any detail you can give me would be useful. 
Don't trust Letho. Well, no shit. I think I trust the people I hunt. He's your foe today, but he wasn't always. Like, why would I ever trust Letho? What do you know about Letho? Uh, how do you know I was a writer? Is there anything to prove I was part of the wild hunt? Nothing. Apart from the fact that Nilfgaardian intelligence agents are drawn and quartered for lying in their reports. Hmm. <laughs> An enlightened nation indeed. You haven't the faintest notion how many people are interested in you. Very yeah, I'm I'm pretty cool. Uh, I am a protagonist man. I don't know if we've been formally introduced. You may be the key to solving the mystery of the retinue, and they all know that. You must watch out for yourself. I sure will. I'll be careful. What do you know about Letho? You know I knew Letho. I've read the reports. I know. Why are you warning me about him? Because I like you. That's Let's all. Let's say you've satisfied my curiosity. Well then, consider me glad to have satisfied a Witcher, whatever the way. Um, I kind of like to try the artifact. I have the device. You realize that can only end badly. Cut in again, and I'll put you in my report. You may use it, but just once. Giving state secrets away to a Nordling. Will you mention that in your report? You're sure to be named a commander one day, Adelbert. But until that happens, be a good boy and do your job. I kind of want her to put like, him on the head. Article 22 is clear. Suspicion of treason is sufficient grounds to strip a commander of power. Article 1 of my personal code is equally clear. Traitors must be subjected to the most painful death possible. Um, I do want... I want the, uh... Steel sword. Okay, please give me the st steel sword. Thanks. Alright. You're... Ah! You got, like, stands, I guess? But they don't have health bars, so it's pretty easy to tell which one is you. What? <laughs> I... No! Oh, dear. Whack. Boy, you're kind of a pussy. So you're, you're, oh, no. You all have health bars. Okay, uh, interesting. Okay, I don't know why the other ones didn't have health bars before, but, uh. Oh, well, I'll, I'll happily kill you. Uh, you tortured Triss, my, my fiery, uh, sort of girlfriend. Ha <laughs> ha! Get fucked. I didn't expect that. Multiplication. Second year at the academy, all majors learn it. I didn't expect you to take my side. Well, now choose one person you wish to contact. After that, the artifact's mine. Interesting. Uh, are you in trouble? If guardian agents get quartered for lying in reports, what does the Empire do to agents who kill their colleagues? Nothing. As long as no one finds out. I see. I heard nothing. Will we meet again? Will we meet again? I wouldn't mind at all. Look for me at the inn. Tell me more about my past. Uh, what do you know about Leth Oh, pff, I... Let's say you've satisfied my curiosity. I read those things Well already. then, consider me glad to have satisfied a... Uh, I'm going to use the I artifact. I if you didn't eavesdrop while I eavesdropped. I shan't trouble you. I have a lot of work to do here. Ooh. Well, no, no, and no. <laughs> think of Saskia, think of Triss. Um. Mm, I'm gonna think your of Triss. Faith is in your hands, sorceress. My fate? You haven't asked a single question about me. Yet it is all up to you. Your situation is a comfortable one. Do not squander your chance. So, wish to tell me anything? I'm a sorceress, an advisor to the King of Temeria. Ah! I believe we agreed you would speak only of things I do not know about. Well, I that didn't tell you much. Mm. I'm 
I'm just sorry I can't use the artifact a few more times. His power has been depleted. I understand. Thanks anyway. All right. Use the artifact. Wait, I already used the artifact. Quest phase completed. Okay. Uh, hold on. Let me check my recording. Oh, level up. Level up. Time for leveling up. Uh, what can I get? Um, chance of critical effects. I don't care about critical effects. Instant kill. I don't care about. Uh, critical. Let's see. Can I get to that one, please? Please. Uh, sword damage plus fifteen percent. Sure. Why not? All right. Hold on. Okay, that is um, that was a lot of footage. So I'm gonna call uh, this episode here. At the end of this, seems like a good place to end it. Next time we'll do some more stuff. We'll go see what's going on in Loch Moine and maybe do some more reading. Reading is for everyone, remember. So I'm gonna say good day to you, internet, and thank you for watching.